Welcome to our first um, online supporters event since since March. Earlier on in the in the chat, we were just reminiscing about our last hundred club event, which was in in Sovereign House on South Parade in Leeds, and it was just before lockdown. And it does now feel like that, yeah, that really strange moment just before. Um, all of our worlds changed. Um, it, it, it was a fantastic evening and a, and a really great event. Um, but 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 actually, just just maybe part of a of a world that we're not going to see for a little while. So um, thank you for for joining us on this new venture, um, this this Zoom event. Thank you for your patience with our first foray into it. We haven't quite worked out all the all the bells and whistles um, and and there are probably things that um, we will we, we'll, we'll learn for next time from from doing this so um, any thoughts or suggestions please please share with us because uh, we'd love to to try and make this a a really engaging and exciting and interesting experience for everybody um, just yeah. until we can all get back together in the room so my first point is if you wouldn't mind could everybody please um mute themselves when they're not um when they're not speaking um it's simply that that will minimize background noise and hopefully maximize people's bandwidth um for um when they when they ask when they do need to speak but also for receive um their reception um if you don't know how to mute um yourself um, I think Rachel, if you, Rachel will, will, will try and help you out. Is that right, Rachel? Um, um, that, that's great. Um, in terms of housekeeping, I don't really have to uh, sign anyone to emergency exits or, or, or anything like that this time, but um, obviously there is that, that mute thing. Clearly we're all listening and, um, and I recognise that this isn't the most ideal way of having the kind of interaction we we love to have at our, our supporters events um, so certainly something that we're hoping to explore for next time is a way where we can be a little bit more interactive um, but what we do have with zoom is the chat facility some of you have found it already which is great um, but down at the bottom of your screen if you move your, your, your um, cursor right down to the bottom of the screen and um, it comes up with some instructions uh, some options and there is a, a, a sort of speech bubble and under it it says chat um, and if you want to press that and, and and use the chat button it means that um, you know if you want to raise a question or, or, or ask how to do something or, or make a suggestion Rachel's going to be moderating that through throughout the convers throughout our conversation so we'll pick up anything that you do put in chat um, second point is if you look at the top left hand of the screen you'll see we are recording this session I know we, we alerted you beforehand to let you know but I'm just reminding you now we are recording this session just so that it's useful for our own uh, reference to see how it goes um, and you know maybe there'll be some really good stuff we can we can um, edit through and 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 use in in various social ways um, but if if anybody does have a problem with with being recorded I think it was pointed out beforehand if you if you put yourself on uh, turn your video off then you're just a name or, or, or rather than uh, being being photographed so that's absolutely your call um, so without further ado I would love us to get started in the into the main event um, I'm really delighted. We've got a couple of, of uh, well, three really exciting um, bits of, 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 of speaking input we have this morning. Um, so without further ado, I'm going to ask my colleague Steph um, to join us. She's uh, come to us <laughs> just before lockdown. We were we were blessed. <laughs> so Steph joined us from um, CAF, from the um, Charities Aid um foundation and and her her experience there and in other quite a, a range of other charities has really been brought um brought to bear instantly um as uh, lockdown kicked in 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 march i think it was two weeks you were with us in the office steph before we all had to go into home working so um a, a really uh, a baptism of fire um for, for steph 
<clears throat> but she's absolutely um, smashed it out of the park in terms of delivery and she's worked really hard as have all of the team to ensure that we could respond appropriately to the emergency situation that we were all facing um, and so I'm, I'm delighted she's going to talk us through what we've been doing over the last uh, over the last four months.